Hey there, good morning and welcome to 4 minutes at 4 a.m. with Kuldeep Iregodo. So today we are discussing about finding your inner strength, cultivating the resilience in the time of adversity. Now, uh, this is one of the most important topic and my favorite topic to explain and things like that. Now, we being a human, we almost every human being, they undergo the time of adversity. That means we sometimes face tough situations. We sometimes get into the lot of challenges. Now, how you can find your inner strength, how you can generate that inner strength from within to face that particular challenge or to beat that time of adversity. Now, there are very, very, and there are so many motivational speeches who have told about how to come out of adversity, how to embrace the change, how to get into the action mode and stuff like that. Now, this just follow these three simple stuff and you will have very very good time and smooth time in finding your inner strength now inner strength is something which is yes it is you who have to cultivate it from within you now in order to support that inner strength to bring that inner strength out what is that three things let us check one by one number one is building resilience through self-care practices and positive mindset this is one of the most important aspect because every day morning or every day you need to build resilience through self-care and positive mindset practice. How you can do that? That is being mindful. Whenever you are mindful enough in whatever the activity you are doing, whatever the tough stuff, stuff you are doing, you should be mindful enough to mind that. Right? That means whatever you are doing, that will definitely help you in your self-care. You will take care of what exactly is going on in your life, how you are coming across or how you are calmly poised in order to deal that particular situation and stuff like that, right? So building resilience through self-care and positive mindset. Positive mindset is very, very important. With that, the second aspect is drawing inspiration from the past success and achievements. No doubt you would have done achieve at least some achievement or some success in your past. Just sit and think about that particular success. Don't think about any other nonsense stuff or don't think about negativity stuff which has happened in your life. Rather, you need to embrace or rather you need to think about the success which you have achieved in your past or whatever the achievements you got. Maybe it from it, it can be from your school days, from your college days or from childhood, whatever it is. Okay, you need to bring or you need to draw that inspiration. Yeah, man, I could have done then that time. Why not now? Whatever may be the adverse time right now, the time will just move on because time is the only essence which keeps changing. Rest, nothing will change. Rest, everything is the same. Only you who have to change. It is your mindset which has to be changed. Right now with that, the third aspect is seeking support from loved ones and community during the tough times. Always, always remember this, okay? You need to seek support from your loved ones, whatever may be, it, it can be your relation, it can be your family members or whoever it is. You need to seek their support. So seeking support from loved one will definitely help you in building or generating your inner strength from within. That is one aspect. Second thing is that you can also go to your community. I know you are nowadays, it is like a hub of the community or hub economy where you are part of one or the other community. Go there and ask for the support or seek help from that particular community. And definitely one or the other person will handhold you and he will help you in this particular tough time. Trust me, it is you who have to go and ask for that help or ask for that support. Automatically, they will handhold you and pull you up in that adverse time. Hope this was useful. This is Kuldeep Peregodo signing off until we meet again in the next day morning. Thank you. Have a great time. Bye-bye.